You can filter and sort your records in both the form and layout view. I'm in the form view right now. You can see down below on the status bar, it's selected form view. And so to filter, well, just go ahead and click inside of any one of these fields that you want to filter for. And you can come up here on the home tab, go to the sort and filter group, and you got the funnel there. Click on it, opens up, and you can, well, let's uncheck select all, and then just go ahead and check those records whose book number begins with, let's do BD and BS, click okie dokie. You can see down below we got a total of four records as opposed to, what was it, 20? Well, the good news is that once you apply a filter, you can toggle back to where it was before it was filtered by either coming over here, and you can see it's filtered. When you hover over, it says on click to remove filter, click on it, we're back to 20, and then it's unfiltered, click on it to apply the filter. And you also have it up above here too in the sort and filter group to toggle back and forth between being filtered well, right now it's not filtered. You got a total of 20 records. It says unfiltered. And then when you toggle, you can see it's highlighted, so it's being filtered. Now, when I close out and I didn't save it, oh my goodness. Now, do I have to do that over again? Let's double click and click on toggle. Hey, it remembers it. That's the good news. The bad news is, is that how do you get rid of it? Well, that's the other good news. I'll show you how to do that to clear this out. And to do that, you can just come up here in the sort and filter group, click on advanced and clear all filters. And we're back to where we started. You get no toggleage. Of course, you can do that in the form view. You can also right click, go to the layout view. And unlike the form view, you can't click inside the actual text box to select the data therein. It just selects the text box in whole, but it's the same thing. You just come up here and let's go to the home tab, go to the sort and filter group, click on filter, and we can go ahead and deselect all, then just choose those. Now you can filter that way, or let me click cancel. Another way to filter is by selection. You can come up here on the home tab to the sort and filter group, and there you go. Click on the drop down arrow where it equals summer in the haunted hotel. We should only have one title by that name, so if I select that, we should just have one of one records. And then we got our toggleage here to go back. Let's go ahead and clear this off, advance to clear all filters. And you can also, well, I tell my students when in doubt, most likely you'll find what you're looking for in the shortcut menu. So if I right click here, do I get any filter here? Well, we do. Equals Summer in Haunted Hotel, or does not equal that, or contains it or doesn't contain it. And we got text filters over to the right where it can equal, select equals, then type in what you want it to equal to. So you get some more options there. You can also do sorting. So let's go ahead and sort it by title with it selected here. We can right click on it and do sort ascending A to Z or descending Z to A or condescending. No, I'm kidding. So you can do it that way. Let's do A to Z. It flips it over and then you can see up here on the home tab in the sort and filter group, it's highlighted showing us that, hey, there's some ascendage going on here and it's for the title. And so it goes from the A's to the B's, best campsites. Great. And we can flip that to descending, going from the Z's up to the A's and going backwards. And then to clear that, well, you can just go ahead and click on remove sorts. Thanks for watching. Hey, as a quick reminder, if you like my video, please give it a thumbs up. You can also click on me and subscribe to my channel to get notified of the latest videos. And for great specials on my products, please see the description below this video.